Hello and welcome everybody. So today I am doing a kind of response video to the video Trisha Paytas, very famous YouTuber made online. And she recently put out a video entitled, Being Gay Is A Choice. And she basically talks about all of her experiences, about how her entire life she felt like she was straight, and then she just decided one day that she was going to be a lesbian, and she met a girl, and she they kind of had a relationship, and then eventually the relationship broke up and she went back to guys. And she was just talking about how her experience, she felt as though being gay, being straight, it was a choice. And it made me a little mad because, first of all, I love Trisha Paytas. Like, if you're one of my friends, you know I am obsessed with her. Like, I love her. I think she's really funny. I think she's entertaining. I think she has great messages, usually. Sorry, that was my phone. And I just, I just, I just like, I like Trisha Paytas. And when I saw this video entitled Being Gay is a Choice, and she just talked about how it's a choice for everyone, it kind of angered me because I was like, oh, what the heck? I know it's not. I know it's not for me. I'm going to get into all that later. I'm going to try to make this video quick because someone freaking left a comment, or not a comment, asked me a question on Ask, basically telling me they were like, yeah, Nathan, your videos are too freaking long. Use, like, something Tyler Oakley does, apparently. They told me, like, he, like, kills dead babies or something. I don't freaking know. Yeah, apparently my videos are too long and lengthy and they hate it. I like it when YouTubers post long videos, especially like me. I don't post that often, maybe once a week if you're lucky. I don't have a schedule or anything. And I like when people post long videos. I like it a lot, especially if I like that YouTuber. I like to watch a long video by them. I don't want to watch a video once a week and it's like three minutes long and it's like, what the heck? No, I do sometimes post like 25 minute long videos. I posted a 45 minute long Minecraft video, I think. But that's not that unusual. Like, gaming videos are usually long. Okay, whatever. I'm getting sidetracked. But anyway, Trisha Paytas, I freaked. I kind of just got angry and I Snapchatted. I put on my story, basically talking about, like, what the heck? I was like, what the heck, Trish? I like you. Why are you saying this? And then I said, no, it, like, I posted a Snapchat um, saying, what the heck, Trish? I liked you. Why do you think this? And then I posted another Snapchat saying, sorry, but it's not a choice. And then one of my friends on my ask, his name is Quinn. Shout out to Quinn. <laughs> But he was like, on my ask, he was like, you know what, I agree with you, and I think Trish is wrong. He thinks that it's not a choice. And then someone freaking freaked out and went on my ask, and they were like, you have no right to tell Trisha Paytas who she is, and if she is freaking bi or straight, like, they were getting all up in it. And I was just kind of like, go away. But let me tell you, I'm not a Trisha Paytas hater. I love Trisha Paytas, and ask any of my friends. I love her and they all hate her so many people hate her all my friends hate her and think she's a whore but i mean she kind of is but i kind of love it i don't know i love her but anyway this is my thoughts on the topic i know for me personally it is not a choice i don't care what people tell me it is not a choice for me if anything it's some kind of unconscious choice that i can't control because i do not ever remember choosing it's not like i'm just like you know what i'm gonna like guys instead of girls it's just not a choice it's not a choice for me and it's just simple as that i don't know how to freaking like explain to people or convince them I'm just believe me why would I freaking lie to you we're like best friends I love you anyway I do believe that for some people it may be kind of a choice I don't know because I'm not them and I can't understand it I think humans in general we are all different and we all try to label things like you're bi, you're straight, you're gay. Like, we try to label things, and you can't. Everyone is different. Everyone is whacked up and creepy. Maybe suddenly one day you want to do someone that you usually don't want to do, someone out of your range, or you're just, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. I mean, there's nothing wrong with trying to label things, because it's how we are. We have to organize things. We have to have it set out so that we can figure everything out. But you know what? Like, I don't think we can label our sexualities, because it's so, everyone is so different, and... This video has gotten nowhere. All I want to say is, I don't hate Trisha Paytas for your, you guys that were telling me that I hate her, that one person. I don't hate Trisha Paytas. I, I like her. Trust me. I'm taking this hat off because I'm just done with it. I'm just done. It's been in the way. It's been making me all hot and sweaty, so we're getting rid of it. But anyway, she basically said that, like, it's a choice for her, and it's not a choice for me, and I think everyone's different, and not everyone is the same. You can't just say, okay, well, for me, I feel like it's a choice, so everyone is a choice. No, Trish, I don't think you can do that. Just like how I think gay people are wrong with going, saying, it's not a choice, no one can decide, or like, it's, because I think some people, I think some people can. I think some people, honestly, have the gift of being able to just, like, girls and boys, and I actually think that they're bi. And Trish legit, she was just like, 
I like guys, and then I can just like girls if I want to. And then she was like, some people would say I'm bi, but I don't think bisexuality is a thing. And those people piss me off. I'm sorry, but those people piss me off that are just like, if you're bi, you should just pick a side. Being like, you should just be only guys. Like, for the rest of my life, I'm just gonna only like guys. Or for the rest of my life, I'm only gonna like girls. Yeah, I don't think you should pick a side. Just one day you'll end up... I think bisexuals are lucky they get everyone to choose from when... If you're straight, you only get half the people, and if you're gay, you get a 10% of the people. Anyway, I hope you guys freaking enjoyed this video. I don't know why you would. I said that in, I say that in every video. I'm always like, why would you enjoy this? I just talked about stupid stuff. If you want to add me on Snapchat to see all my sm crazy Snapchat stories about how much I hate Trish and everything like that, you can add me at Nathan underscore Verky. Maybe I'll Snapchat you back. You never know. And yeah, any other links? Oh, stop adding me as a friend on Facebook, people. People will add me as a friend, and I'll just be like, no. And then they'll add again, and I'll be like, no. And then they'll add again, and I'll be like, no. I only add people I know. Maybe if we're already internet friends, I'll add you. But if you're just some random person that I've never talked to, I don't... My Facebook is my personal Facebook. I want my friends to be on there. I don't want random strangers. So I will not add you. So quit trying to add me as a friend. I only add people that I already know. Thank you. Yeah, that's all off my chest. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to ask me more questions, tell me I'm wrong, tell me I'm right. Either leave a comment in the description or go on my ask and say, Nathan, you're a freaking idiot. I hate you. Just kidding. Don't say that because I probably won't answer it. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye.